Arrival is a tough interview because there's just so much stuff in it where you could just spoil the movie and you really want to leave it for the audience. Uh, but this one we can answer. Uh, the the uh, uh, character I play is General Shang. He is the leader of the Chinese military. Uh, high, well known, highly respected, and feared by all the uh, uh, armed forces around the world. And he has a particular peculiar nickname called the Big Domino. Please go see that film. I mean, really, if, if nothing else, I, I just feel that it's one of those films where, where you, you walk out of that place and you look at the world a little differently. We're breaking the boundaries of network. It's very tough, tough when you have to, you're using public airwaves, so you have certain constraints that you cannot deal with, and subject matter-wise. But now, given the fact that we have this kind of wide open landscape of really writing and creating anything you want, I think it takes the handcuffs off. And all the good writers are moving into you know, all these other ways of telling stories other than network. So it's very exciting for us as actors. We're reading, we're reading better scripts. You know, and much more open in terms of your contribution as, as a creative contributor, you know, instead of just sitting around going, okay, here's the script, I gotta do exactly what the script says, right? But now you're actually able to explore a little more. The different characters I was able to play this year, it's pretty fascinating. Singaporean, oh, did a, a Ransom, which is a new show for CBS, also written by uh, uh, Frank Spotness, who created Man in High Castle. And there, there's a show fairly, really interesting about a crisis inf intervention team that goes around the world but based on a, a, a real group of people. So that's fascinating. And I played a, a senator who is of uh, who is a uh, uh, Laotian uh, uh, descent. So I'm able. I'm kind of like doing the Meryl Streep of, of Asian American <laughs> actors, <laughs> playing with these different accents and stuff. It's been a lot of fun. And General Onoda, of course, you know. Maina High Castle, who's a Japanese uh, general. So it's wonderful.